robotic. Next is the uh, anomalies. Anomalies. We know that uh, B glucose, that means uh, open structure of B glucose on cyclization will give two stereoisomeric forms that is uh, alpha D glucose and uh, beta D glucose. So, D glucose on cyclization, on cyclization. What do you mean by cyclization? Uh, the aldehyde group will interact with the OH group of the fifth carbon present in the open structure and we get two diastereomers one is uh, alpha D glucose and uh, beta D glucose that is uh, see look at it here we get uh, C O H H C H O H C O H H C H O H C H and uh, here it is uh, okay and here it is uh, CH2 OH what is this one this is uh, alpha D glucose what is this one alpha D uh, glucose alpha D glucose okay the other one is uh, what is the uh, what uh, in alpha D glucose we can see that the OH group is at the right hand side of the chiral carbon OH group is at the right hand side of the chiral carbon and in beta group uh, D glucose you can see that the OH group is at the, at the left hand side so we get C O H H C H O H C O H H C H O H C H and okay and here it is uh, CH2 O H CH2 O H so this is uh, beta D glucose beta D glucose now look at it here what is the difference between these two stereoisomers or uh, what is the difference between these two diastereomers we can see that uh, these are diastereomers which differ in configuration only at the newly formed chiral carbon these two configurations are differ only at the newly formed chiral carbon that means uh, in the first structure the OH group is at the right hand side of the chiral carbon and in the beta D glucose OH group is at the left hand side of the chiral carbon that means uh, these two diastereomers are differ in configuration only at the newly formed chiral carbon and that chiral carbon is formed by the cyclization of the open structure. Such diastereomers, such diastereomers, diastereomers which differ in configuration only at the chiral carbon, such diastereomers are called anomers or, or epimers. Another name is uh, epimers. Okay. So that is important. This type of diastereomers are called anomers or epimers. So what is the definition for anomers or epimers? Anomers or epimers are diastereomers which differ in configuration only at the chiral carbon which is produced by the cyclization of the open uh, structure. Okay, they are known as uh, this type of uh, diastereomers are known as uh, anomers or uh, epimers. That is very important. This is our newly formed uh, chiral carbon. This is our newly formed chiral carbon. How that newly formed chiral uh, uh, carbon is formed by the cyclization of the uh, by the cyclization of the open structure. So what is happening by cyclization? We can see that uh, the chiral carbon. I'm uh, sorry, the carbonyl carbon present in the blue glucose is converting to a chiral carbon so uh, the carbonyl group that means uh, the CO group present in the aldehyde uh, is converting to uh, a chiral center so we get uh, uh, two diastereomers they are known as uh, anomers or uh, epimers okay
another example example for uh, uh, this anomers or epimeres we can see that uh, uh, d glucose I uh, will give two types of uh, methyl glucosides. Uh, I will give two uh, types of methyl glucosides when treated with uh, uh, methanol in presence of dry HCl. So, uh, D glucose, D glucose will give two types of uh, uh, D uh, glucose. D glucose will give two types of uh, two types of. Uh, uh, methyl methyl uh, glucosides glucosides when treated with glucosides when treated with when treated with treated with methanol 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 in presence of uh, dry HCl in presence of dry HCl uh, two types of methyl glucosides look at here we get uh, uh, H O C H three C H O H C O H H C H O H C H and here it is C H two O H. What is this one? This is methyl methyl alpha D. Uh, what is that uh, glucoside uh, gluco glucoside okay methyl alpha d glucoside uh, 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 glucoside and uh, uh, this is alpha methyl alpha d glucoside and uh, we get uh, here it is OCH3 uh, H uh, C H O H C O H H C H O H C H C H two O H and here is our uh, what is this one? This is a uh, uh, methyl methyl uh, beta D glucoside. So we get uh, what is uh, what we get uh, with these two are uh, epimeres or uh, anomers. We get uh, epimeres or uh, anomers. These are truly uh, our uh, these are epimeres or uh, anomers. So, uh, we get when. Uh, D glucose is treated with uh, methanol and in presence of dry HCl we get uh, epimeres or uh, anomers which are the epimeres or anomers uh, methyl alpha D glucose and the methyl B D, uh, D glucose okay these are uh, this is what is uh, anomers or uh, epimeres thank you